Sunday, 25th of May, in the mine as you can see. I'm a little bit grubby, just a little bit. But up here, with some fabulous news, there's Mick and Pete. Pete who looks like a total slime ball. Get your lights out the camera. As I said, you can see Pete. He's absolutely rotten. And what have you got to tell the people? Look at the little artifact first. Oh, have his How many people will know what that is? We're going to have a look at his little thing. I don't know, where is this? Uh, we have a theory that it may be a marker pin. It might be a marker pin, but uh, there's a handful of them sitting on a rock ledge. So and they've been lying. Anyway, in, how long have they been lying in the mine? 150 years. And they're hardly rusty. It's uh, almost blue steel. It's a um, little steel on it. But hey, oh folks. So this is this is what you look like when you've uh, just broken into the next big set of flats in Green Laws on the East Bain. Uh, we found a little hole earlier on today and we've been rat holing it and making it bigger. And uh, I've just slivered through the little hole uh, into quite a large tunnel. It's as big as this, uh, much bigger than the, the other side that we've been in. Um, in the middle of a level, there's a beautiful old wheelbarrow, um, tallow candles on the walls, uh, drink bottles, all sorts of artifacts, and uh, totally different. It's, it's big stacked deads, tunnels running off in all directions, um, workings everywhere. Uh, the whole place is absolutely riddled with floor spar, but um, very different mineralogy, very different structure, very different chemistry. Um, none of the yellow. But surprisingly, most of it is, is, or certainly looks to be, bright green. So we don't know until we get it out and have a look at it in daylight, but completely, utterly different to, uh, to what we've been in so far. So um, quite, a, quite a turn up. Uh, we don't really know what to expect yet, but there's going to be a lot of exploration. It's going to take a while to explore these workings um, and find out just where they go. The air in there seems to be quite fresh. So whether they connect with anything else, I don't know. But, um, four and a half years of digging. Fingers crossed. Um, and we're certainly starting to break into those workings. We've, we've got our main entrance now that will take us right the way back to, uh, to the hydraulic shaft. Um, most of the workings are fairly well interconnected. Uh, if they're not, there's only six foot runs of ground between the various workings. So we might have to mine a bit of a tunnel through. Uh, but I think we're we're on the uh, we're on the edge of it. So uh, a great day, a really great day, and we're uh, we're all exhausted. So I think we're going to go down the pub and have a yeah. celebratory beer. Or two, or three. Or two, or oh three. God! <laughs> Would you like to? Uh, while I hold this. No, you're alright. Are you sure? That's enough? it, folks. Till the next thrilling instalment. Goodbye. <laughs>